Yes, and uh, here at the Pentagon during uh, the ceremonies, uh, the speakers, uh, the chairman of the Joint Chiefs, Mark Milley, as well as the Secretary of uh, Defense, Lloyd Austin, uh, both spoke about uh, the ongoing mission of uh, the uh, Pentagon, of the uh, Department of Defense, and of uh, all those people who still uh, work here. Uh, he said that that mission uh, continued. Uh, no matter what the enemy looks like, that mission is to protect protect the republic and to protect uh, the values uh, of the United States, freedom, democracy. And they both had uh, very uh, strong words and they both uh, had this idea of looking to the past and also uh, looking to the future. Uh, Lloyd Austin actually uh, reminded the audience that uh, the uh, first construction work for the Pentagon uh, started on a September 11th back in 1941. He said at the time uh, the enemy was uh, Nazi uh, Germany. Uh, the uh, country uh, was at war and uh, that uh, those uh, first steps in building uh, the Pentagon resonate, uh, resonated on September 11th, 2001, when those people came to work on uh, that fateful morning uh, with 184 people uh, losing uh, their lives, coming to work for that same mission, to protect uh, the republic and to defend American values. And he said that it resonated again today for those people still here uh, this September 11th here at uh, the Pentagon. He said that uh, that fight continued uh, no matter who uh, the enemy was. Uh, General uh, Mark Milley also uh, spoke about the enemies of the past, the Nazis, the communists, but also uh, the current enemies. And he mentioned Al-Qaeda, ISIS, and the Taliban. The Taliban, uh, who uh, are a people that the United States is currently working with, cooperating with, uh, that uh, in the past few weeks for those evacuations that we saw uh, as uh, America's longest war uh, was uh, coming uh, to an end, uh, the Americans had to work with the Taliban, and they continue in some way to cooperate uh, with the Taliban. But for Mark Milley, uh, the Taliban are clearly a, a threat, an enemy of uh, the United States. And both men uh, insisted that uh, this is the mission that continues, uh, that they will always fight for the republic. They will always fight uh, for uh, that freedom, uh, that democracy, uh, that liberty. And he said that the memory of those people who uh, died here at the Pentagon in 2001 is also alive through the people who come here to work every day in order to protect the United States going forward.